President Putin claims Queen Elizabeth is not human. What did you say again? I said. President Putin from Russia claims Queen Elizabeth is not human. The biggest secret, do reptilian human hybrids run our world? Brave Vladimir Putin has told senior staff and associates that Queen Elizabeth II is not human but is a reptilian that shapeshifts between human and reptile form and according to sources close to the president he has witnessed her shapeshift in the flesh, before his very eyes, and in his opinion, as a warning to him personally. She shifted between this form and her human state Putin met the Queen at the 70th anniversary of the D-Day landings in Normandy. France in 2014. He was widely criticized by the Western media for failing to help the monarch up the stairs, and keeping his distance from her in general. It has now emerged that Putin stayed as far away from the Queen as possible because he witnessed her shapeshift moments earlier. The Queen has a long reptile face, almost like a beak, and she is a sickly greyish watercolor. Her hands turned into reptile hands she shifted between this form and her human state three or four times while greeting Putin. He also saw her shape shift later while she was being helped to her position for the world leaders photo op by Barack Obama and New Zealand's Governor General Jerry Maitpau. Her hands turned into reptile hands while they helped her up the stairs. When she smiled her teeth changed into sharp reptile teeth and glistened. Putin has told senior staff and close associates that he believes she shapeshifted while greeting him as a show of strength and a warning not to mess with the dominant reptilian Illuminati bloodline of which she is a high priestess. Putin's first-hand experiences with the reptilian Illuminati chime with my own research and second-hand accounts. I have dedicated the last five years to researching the elusive, tyrannical powers that rule our world, traveling to over 80 countries and it never ceases to amaze me how many people from very different walks of life have told me stories about seeing people briefly turn into reptilians before their very eyes. Some of their faces turn reptilian I've been told this by Californian news anchors, Ethiopian goat herds, and Australian aboriginals, just to name a few. A Danish taxi driver described driving past a group of VIP guests at the 2014 Bilderberg meeting in Copenhagen and seeing some of their faces turn reptilian and some of their hands and feet take on a reptilian look. In Peru a respected psychic told me she sees people in power, like Obama, David Cameron, and Hillary Clinton, turn into reptiles whenever she watches an international news channel. The world's ruling class have tyrannical control over the mainstream media, as well as our food, water, and air supply, and they are actively dumbing down the masses. The evidence against them, ancient and modern, is enormous and continuing to grow. Who has allowed the Pentagon's top control structure to go renegade? The answer is that a lot of powerful USG officials that should have done their jobs and stopped this hijacking of the American military by the world's largest organized crime syndicate. This syndicate is also the world's largest opium cartel, the world's private bloodline money changers who run almost every monetary creation and lending system. And their top leaders are known to be secret battle worshippers continuing the same anti-human evil occult practices all the way back to ancient Babylonia. These practices include infant and child sacrifice and mass sacrifices of thousands and millions innocents using wars. These parasites believe they get supernatural powers from shedding the blood of innocents and sacrificing them to Bell, Lucifer, Gordon Duff. Veterans Today editors note, with the current meltdown of the British government tied to an almost identical scandal, and it is very much about satanic human sacrifice, not just butchering and killing children for no reason. As reported, one would think a publication other than VT would have the guts to carry these stories. These ritual killings are part of a belief system on the part of the black nobility and key families. You can name them easily where they cement their relationships with the demonic, non-corporeal entities that help them maintain control over our government and media. Choose to believe or not, you and your family live in slavery because of this, we fight wars to feed their blood frenzy. All of this is very real. Another aspect of this dynamic are traditional, multi-generational family infestations which are more than voluntary. 
VT insiders have attended infestation rituals. These occur on Corfu for the Rothschilds or its Skull and Bones, Yale, Bush family and others, or Bohemian Grove or at the Denver Solstice. In Washington, the evangelical prayer breakfast cult outings help not only bond power brokers to one another but to their non-corporeal associates as well. The biggest secret, do reptilian human hybrids run our world? Lizard-like aliens from outer space inhabit human bodies and control the human race. Videos similar to the footage of the reptilian Hillary Clinton that Heen referred to number in the hundreds on YouTube. They join part of a much larger body of thousands of videos uploaded by conspiracy theorists in the reptilian circle that purportedly show proof of live, on-camera, human shape shifting from human to lizard form. The videos typically feature news interviews with national political figures like Hillary, Queen Elizabeth II or George H. W. Bush, or segments from TV news broadcasts. Some of the footage is doctored to place lizard-like slitted pupils in the eyes of political elites, or is slowed down to mutate the voice of the speaker and enhance the semblance of a lizard-like hiss emanating from the mouth of say, a local TV news woman's tendency to sustain the S in plural nouns. Amateur reptile video detectives can find lizard traces almost anywhere.